course in the uh, new Minchin laser cam. So first out of the box is the instructions. This gives you all the detailed guide on how to put it together. And first out of the box is the power cable and uh, plug. So you've got two or three different uh, cables there, the ethernet cable, um, some tools, and the back bracket and uh, a laser guide. Um, some inserts and the actual frame itself. If it, we have a 3D printed camera holder as well. Various bolts of all different sizes and then the camera itself. This is Wi-Fi enabled. It also can, it comes with an SD card, which is 32 gig. And that's the unboxing. Okay, so when putting it together, we're gonna to follow the guide and it's asking me to put two bolts into here to connect up to the camera. And well, first we're gonna push the camera into the actual um, 3D printed slot and using the bolt and connect it up. And then we're gonna connect it up to the upper frame. So it's quite easy, just put those two bolts in, tighten it up. And we'll put that to one side in a minute. So now using the four bolts supplied, we're gonna connect up the upper frame to the support frame. Um, literally it's four bolts into there and it can move backwards and forwards depending on side of your laser. So we're gonna, you can move the actual camera to different angles and then we can connect it up to the laser I'm using and it's just got a, a screw thread and you tighten it up to the frame at the back. Connection part, you just need to put the first cable in there which is the power cable and um, plug that in. The second cable is the cable for the light burn connection to the actual laser itself, the ethernet connection. Um, and then the final thing is the data cable um, and that connects up. Um, bit of cable management as well. Connect up to the app. So you first need to download the Beagle Engraver app and then add your Wi-Fi password, which I've blanked out for data protection. And, and then once you've added that, it will load up onto the actual screen, give you a QR code. You scan that on the camera and you'll hear um, a sound and you just agree that you've heard it and go on to the next step. That's then connecting to the camera, which takes a period of time. And then once it's connected, you have a live view of that. Just tap on the screen and that will bring up everything that you can see on your camera. This through the app and uh, once you've managed to do certain engraving and as you can see you then have to do the camera alignment which is all through light burn and then over to this part of the video which is testing the camera setup so I've, I've done all the calibration and as you can see when I move the actual item which is a piece of wood and then update the overlay on light burn there are some videos online about that Minchin actually provides you with a how-to guide um, I'm going to move the Minchin um, wording onto there probably have to shrink it down so everything you see on there is live on the actual camera um, you just update the overlay every time then we have like an SVG of a beagle dog it's not quite the one that Minchin uses but it's something just for a bit of fun and to prove that the actual camera works and that you can use it for functional reasons um, you can time lapse with this and uh, so I'm just going to put thanks to Minchin for um, sending me this camera to, to do a review on. It, I'm going to be using it. It's really, any sort of Minchin products I've used have always been really great to use and been functional and easy to set up. That's the one thing I like about them. So as you can see. Okay, a quick word from today's video sponsor, PCBWay.com. As you can see from the website, it's really easy to use. They have an instant quote system. They do uh, PC board prototyping, PCB assembly, rigid flex. Um, they also do 3D printing services and CNC services. So if you click on each of those different sections, they will take you into like a quote system where you can select exactly your requirements. They deliver worldwide and they have instant payments. They're, they're well respected within the um, prototyping community. And that's pcbway.com today's video sponsor thank you to pcbway.com be where everything is now um, and what we're going to do is just change the actual cut um, speeds and uh, power on the actual light burn itself um, we don't want it too fast so we're just going to adjust that to suit this particular material we're using which is a thin piece of wood and then once that's set up we can then go over to the camera um, 
and then press home on the actual laser and off we go that's the alignment complete as you can see it's lasering now onto the actual product using the beagle camera and it's come out exactly right thanks to minchin for sending this over to me to review so you can also carry out live streams using this so as you can see from the next clip this is an overview so using the mobile app i can monitor it and you can record as well um, and as you can see here this is a laser cam view and i'm also using one of my minchin cameras for live streaming or time lapsing and this was a time lapse of a stormtrooper using scratch paper now everything is um you can actually live stream to the public as well so if you have a youtube channel like myself or social media you can use that So heading over to their website now, some useful information, um, some costing. So right now the new laser cam is quoted at being at around £105 and that's UK, um, which I think is an excellent price. They also deliver worldwide so you can choose from your um, area. Um, free shipping over a certain amount of money. There's lots of other things that you can add to that package if you so require it. Um, the actual the actual camera itself is multiple purpose so you can use it for many different types of lasers it's a plug and play you can also have trace images it's got an aluminium frame time lapsing offline engraving etc and 1080p you can also light burn wireless bridge which you need to upgrade to the uh, correct firmware depending on your light burn and the actual app itself um, obviously you can use it for various different things such as working in enclosure and like I say um, precise positioning as well which obviously the camera alignment is key batch engraving if you want to do more than one item image tracing these are all things that you can do or just monitoring it these are the different types of cameras so this is the new version as you can see from the middle the specs are slightly different to the previous version Again, to mention for sending me this new laser cam to review I'm going to be putting this into good use um, and like I say it's multi-purpose so check out other videos I should have coming soon on this thanks again for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel take care everyone Phil from 3DP UK